Wheelchairs can be a large expense for those that are already going through so many treatments. So if you have one that is not being used right now, or someone you know has one that's available, as well as crutches and walkers, stay tuned and I'll tell you how you can donate it. Ken Pembridge volunteers for Wheels for the World, an organization that donates wheelchairs to those in need. Can you explain the story of your accident and how you got involved in wanting to do this ministry? Uh, back in the 60s, I was in a bad automobile accident in California, and I had a compression fracture of L3. And I missed being a paralytic by an eighth of an inch, and the doctor wanted to fuse it, and I asked him what were the chances. He said 50-50, and I said, let the good doctor do it, the good surgeon, anyway. And then here a couple years ago, I was driving in the car, and I heard this Johnny Erickson Trotta come on and looking for volunteers to pick up wheelchairs for her kids. I made a phone call, and I got involved in picking up wheelchairs, walkers, and crutches for her kids. And with this, they... After I collect them, they send them to a prison, and the prisoners recondition them. And then after they're reconditioned, they're sent to either third world countries or even in the United States here, and with a Bible and a physical therapist and an occupational therapist. So when they reach the docks, they're not being stolen. And um, that's basically how I got involved, and it's a, I felt it was a great organization to get involved with because I was almost a paralytic. So. Needless to say, that's my payback, I guess, you want to call it. Within the past few years, you have collected about 600 of these um, medical items to give to people. How do you collect them? Where do you get them from? Well, I get them from uh, medical uh, supply companies that are going out of business or people that have lost loved ones and don't know how to get rid of a wheelchair or a walker or crutches or even out for the curb by the garbage. All right, well, thank you so much for sharing a little bit about your ministry. And if anyone else is interested about donating, you can check out my blog at sesquihannaexpress.blogspot.com.